Good morning, good afternoon everybody. We'll start our log tips number 5 made by Phil Wilson. At the end of the video, if you do not understand anything, do please drop your question. I will be always here to give you our guys an answer. Phil Wilson, aka Madison's. I'm going to be explaining you guys why do I call my drill up fit loss. So, welcome to this video. Today's video tips number one is gonna be about patience, right? Whatever you gotta be doing in life, from your drill logs to your job to whatever you gotta be doing, you got you gotta be patient, right? The more patient you are, the more you're gonna get good results, right? You might be in a rush and think you might get a result. You might get a result, but it's not gonna be as good as when you were, you know, patient, right? Always be patient. When you start your drill log, your hair doesn't go very fast. Your hair is not looking up very fast. You might be wondering and asking yourself always why is it that you know my friend hair is growing faster and my hair is not growing faster why is it that my friend hair is looking up very faster and my hair is not looking up very fast right people always be you know asking themselves these questions right your hair is not looking up very fast be patient your hair is not growing up very fast look for supplement and be patient right after one year after all you're gonna look okay you're gonna see good results right i'm growing hair here because i want to get like a full head you know full head rate i'm patient again until after eight months i'm gonna go you know and use the crochet again and then choose them right can, can y'all guys see my droid why do i call my drill up fit loss is because i'm fit and i'm cutting the drill locks the best way to get it like a you have more better looks with the drill ups is to stay fit right get a bicep triceps you know this is the reason why i call my trade you know fit locks because i'm fit and on top of that i've got my trade locks right guys i'm just pumping outside today because because of the covid 19 you know gyms are closed nothing else to do right no movies no nightclub no gym nothing else right that's how we live in this place right so i'm just doing my push-up today after this push-up i'm going home straight away just to go half shower i used to do it i'm doing it every day but whenever whenever i'm coming here you know i always sport clothes so what i'm doing just doing my 40 push-up times four in the morning that's gonna be you know 160 push-ups again 160 push-ups you know in the evening after my after shower after my work before going to bed so that's gonna be two or gonna be 320 push-ups a day that's what i'm doing to keep myself you know fit you know most of the time that's all about for these tips let's move on to the next tips which is going to be moisturizing your hair right if you ever wanted to moisturize your hair always make sure to use substances that you know are really good for your hair some people go for water however whenever they spray water on their hair you know their hair are allergic right their hair breaks they get more drier and then breaks right so in this case you can change from water to something else right it could be olive oil do make sure that i go for heavy oil because most of the people think the heavier the oil means that your hair is, is going to be moisturized right that's not the case go for lighter oil and let's say if you moisturize your hair today wait for two or three days after that you know go rinse up your hairs right this is going to give you you know a healthy hair scalp and whoever's talking about healthy hair scalp gotta be talking about hair growth right the lighter the oil the better right if your forehead is big like mine try and wear some bandana right so wear some bandana from your forehead until your hair get much more longer right because when your dread get more longer you, know, you can use some some side that's gonna suit your forehead right my forehead is naturally big right you gotta be patient 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 you try one thing today it doesn't work change try something else again right by trying different things you get to learn i've never been infected because you know i've been wearing always my mask and i have been always you know practicing social distancing i have been always washing my hands always avoid touching my face when i'm wearing my mask i avoid touching my face without washing my hands right do not trust anybody. Do not take any passenger in your cars, public transport. Spray on anything before your hands touch them. Right? If it's shopping center doors, if your own car doors. I got this shoe from China, right? I gotta spray on it. Never know. We never know you were whatever it's got coronavirus or not, right? So I'm doing if you if you receive anything from overseas, right? Just get this one, spray on it. Right? I'm gonna keep it outside, right? For 24 hours before wearing them, right? And you use, I'm gonna keep them here, right here. Take it out of the plastic. Okay. I'm gonna keep them right here. So the sunshine, if there's any virus inside, the sunshine is gonna kill it, right? So that's how you gotta be doing.